to reset the KT400 controller to its factory setting. First, we start by adding power to the controller. So, we locate the power terminal and add the AC power, no battery. And then, we'll have to locate the reset button and the jumpers. We have two types of KT400. In both cases, we'll have a reset button and we have JP2 and JP3. So, to reset the controller, we remove both jumpers, JP2, JP3, then we press the reset button. We'll look at the Vital LED heartbeat pattern. As you can see in that video, we are we removing the jumpers and then we gonna press the reset button. The Vital LED becomes steady and about 15 to 30 seconds it will start flashing continuously. The continuous long pulse means the controller is factory default. That's it. We're done with the reset. Thank you.